This is Twit. Now, first things first, your launcher needs to look the part. Now, granted, there's only so much we have control over without root access on your device, and I'm keeping this episode free of that nerdy requirement to include as many people as I can in this transformation. So, changing the device level buttons that perform the home, back, and multitasking functions isn't really doable, meaning instead of seeing the lollipop styled shapes, you're stuck with the standard buttons. For the other things though, let's take a look at Nova Launcher, an app that I've used literally for years as my replacement launcher. Nova offers an overwhelming number of customization options, which is its strength, especially for the purposes of this exercise. Nova is meant to be a launcher replacement that sticks relatively close to stock, but offers the ability to tweak everything from the home screen to dock layout to the app drawer, as well as a number of other visual tweaks gesture commands, and powerful backup features that make it easy to try new things and easily bounce back to your favorite layouts. And Nova has a number of preset tweaks that are tailor-made to echo some of the design and action from Lollipop. Some of these actually released this week, so let's put it all to use. First, before we head to settings, on your home screen, long press the app drawer icon and then hit edit. Then tap the image and swipe to the left. We'll change that to the solid white background version that is present in Lollipop. Now go to the folder settings and turn folder preview to line. Next set the folder transition animation to circle if it isn't already. Now go to desktop settings and set the persistent search bar to the Lollipop style. Also, you want to make sure that the scroll indicator is set to the dots with the larger dot in the center and set the scroll effect to none. Now go to the drawer settings and set the transition animation to circle and the scroll effect to none. Now you could set the background color to white for your drawer, though it doesn't exactly match Lollipop's app drawer style perfectly, so that's entirely up to you. Now go to look and feel and set the app animation to slide up, set scroll speed and animation speed to stock, and finally, you can either apply one of Nova's stock icon themes called Lollipop to skin some of the system level app icons to better match their Lollipop counterparts. Or you can do what I prefer by downloading the Moonshine icon pack that updates not only system apps, but literally hundreds of popular apps with a flatter Lollipop inspired icon that really makes things pop. And finally, install the Material Wallpapers Android L app in the Play Store and choose from a wide range of authentic version L wallpapers for your background, pulled from Lollipop. And right there, we have something that immediately feels just a bit more L. Nova Launcher is free with a paid version that offers the full range of functionality at $4. You can also find the Moonshine Icon Pack for free and finally, Material Wallpaper's Android L is also free in the Play Store. That ought to get you started.